Good morning, kindergarten friends, or maybe it's afternoon and you're doing this, or maybe it's evening, but hello. I'm so glad to be here with you today for another day of our ABC Boot Camp. So, I know some of you are already shouting out our letter today. You're right. Today is D for ABC Boot Camp. Okay, so I have big uppercase D, and I have little lowercase D. All right, so we're going to touch D, and we're going to say D because that's the sound that D makes, right? Sometimes people like to say D says duh, but D just says D, D, like that, okay? So let's take my D, D dog pointer and touch the D and say my name is D and my sound is D. You ready? Watch the dog. My name is D and my sound is D. So if your name starts with D, there might be some of you out there. Go ahead and stand up and do a little dance because today's your day. Ooh, D day. Did you hear that? That's a D word. Okay, let's get started and look at our D pictures. Okay. All right. First one is an animal that starts with a D. You're right. It's a D duck. So let's look on the back. There's the word duck. And I'll take my marker. It's actually a smelly marker today. Ooh, cherry. And let's pull back around, up and down to write my little D. And I'm going to write the word duck. Duck says D. All right, next picture. Leave that wood off, I guess, since I'm still writing with it. Um, you have one of these. You probably have a lot of these at your house. It's a D door. Door says D. Let's add that one here. Pull back around, up and down for my little D. And there's the word door. Door. Oh, I bet some of you might have these at home. It's a D doll. There's the word doll. Sorry, sometimes I think I forget to show you the word on the back, but it's going to match the word we put up here. D doll starts with a D. Okay. Aw, these animals are very sweet. I love them. D deer. There's the word deer. Oops, sorry, sometimes it's hard to get it straight for you. There's deer starts with a D. Let's add that here. Pull back around, up and down for the D. And then deer. Deer starts with a D. Okay, I think we just have one more picture today. It's a d, d dish, right? Dish would start with a D. Let's add that down here. Pull back around, up and down. Dish, and then I think I'm gonna also start showing you um, the yellow cards. You know how I did the yellow cards with you? Well, um, I'll show you the card each day, I think, for that letter. So, d, d dog, just like my dog pointer is on that D card that we practiced. So let's write dog. Pull back around, up and down, and there's the word dog. All right, now I haven't um, put the word up here yet for our picture today for our alphabet book. That's because it's gonna be a big D for our word, okay? It's gonna be somebody's last name. So the last name that I put up here is Duncan because we have a teacher whose name is Mrs. D Duncan. And since it's her last name, it has to have a big uppercase D. Okay. So that's why it looks different from the other words because this is an uppercase D and these are all lowercase. So Mrs. Duncan might be, some of you might have her for a teacher, okay? So if Mrs. Duncan is your teacher, raise your hand and say, woo, me, because you get to color a picture of your teacher today. How awesome is that? Okay, but first we need to um, go through and read these words together like we do every day. And this spot's blank, right? Usually if you were in class right now, um, that is where your teacher would ask you to name lots of D words and you would get to come up with your own D words to add there. So. Right now, while you're sitting there, I want you to say out loud some more D words that you can think of, okay? And pretend like I can hear all those words. D, 
D good job with all those d, d words you did. Very good. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead. I'm going to switch to my dog pointer because I like that dog. I'll read it. You read it back to me. Here we go. Dog. Deer. Duck. Door. Doll. Dish. Duncan. Did you say all those words that started with a D? Very good. And then you thought of more that we would have put over here. Okay, so you probably already know what to get out, but I'm going to remind you just in case you forget, out of your white box, you need to get the book that looks like this. It's got the ABC book at the top. And you hopefully you put your name in there like I put my name in there. All right, so you're going to get that one. That's the one that has all the pictures that you've already done. And then you need to get the one with the three army guys on top that has the new picture that you're going to color. Okay, so you need those two books. And you need crayons. You need scissors. And you need glue. Okay, so if you need to go back and hear all that again, just make it go back so you remember what you need to get. You are going to open up to your D page in this book with the army guys and you're going to see Mrs. D Duncan. You probably recognize her from a lot of the videos that you're doing right now. You see her in those videos, okay? So Mrs. Duncan looks like this on your page. Okay? She doesn't have anything, any colors on her yet. And you're probably wondering, well, how do I color her? Well, I'll show you how I colored her. I kind of just colored her. I put some long eyelashes on her. I thought that would be fun. I know Mrs. Duncan, she's my friend, and I know sometimes she likes to wear lipstick or lip gloss, so I put some lipstick on her. And then her shirt, I thought she would look really pretty in purple, so I gave her a purple shirt. Um, I even gave her like a little eyeshadow up there. It's kind of probably hard for you to see how I did it exactly on the computer. But you get to you get to color her however you want. And Mrs. Duncan's hair is brown. I should have probably put some brown on her hair to make it darker. Okay, so just make her colorful however you want. And um, you will color her in this book. Right here, you're gonna color her in this book, okay? And then you're gonna cut her out and you're gonna put her into this book, just like I did. Remember how we glued the pictures from here into here. And let's go to mine, there she is again. And don't forget to trace big uppercase D because Mrs. Duncan has a big uppercase D in her last name. And then do your little lowercase D, okay? And that's all for today practice D words all day long today. Look around your house for things that start with a D. Go in your backyard and look for things that start with a D. And I can't wait to see you another day. Bye guys.